weenies, lynx, franks, red hots. Hot dogs are a simple dish consisting of a bun, sausage, and your choice of toppings. Sold at sporting venues and street vendors alike, hot dogs have been enjoyed by everyone for decades. But have you ever wondered what's inside a hot dog? We'll give you a hint. It's definitely not like other meats out there. With so much mystery surrounding the food we love so much, this begs the question, how are hot dogs made? Let's find out on Feed My Curiosity. Dash Hound sausages were brought over to America by German immigrants Charles Feltman and Antoine Fettwagner. Topped with sauerkraut, from a pushcart in Coney Island, New York, they made their way throughout baseball parks and quickly became a popular treat enjoyed by North Americans. But what about the hot dogs we know and love today? Hot dogs are made with the idea that no part of the animal should be left over. Once the ribs, steaks, chops, breasts, thighs, and hams are extracted from the animal, there's still some leftover grizzle, fat, and offal. And instead of letting all of that go to waste, people figure that it's all still edible and should be used for food. The process of making hot dog sausages starts with pre-cooking the contents at between 65 to 87 degrees Celsius, which gets rid of any bacteria. This also separates the remaining muscle meat, fat, and connective tissues from head and feet bones, making trimmings more manageable and easy to prepare. Once the pre-cooking is finished, meat battering, or the actual process of making hot dogs, begins. First, the pork or beef trimmings are ground up in a machine and squeezed through grated metal plates. Ground chicken trimmings may also be added into the mixture, which is then blended until it becomes the meat batter we spoke of earlier. Salt, ground spices, and food starches are added with water and a sweetener like corn syrup. The spices that are used depend on where the sausages are being made. Afterwards, more water is added until the desired consistency is achieved. The mixture is pureed again, with the excess air vacuumed out. The meat is then pumped into casings, which is usually made of cellulose tubing, then hung on racks and cooked in a smokehouse. Once the cooking is complete, the meat is chilled with cold salt water to prepare it for packaging. If natural casings, like animal intestines, were used, they're left on. The final stage is inspection performed manually by humans. They discard the bad sausages while the good ones are sent to a machine for packaging and are then shipped to grocery stores for consumers to pick up, cook at home, and enjoy. There are so many different ways for hot dogs to be prepared, but they all go through a similar process to make the finished product we know and love. With so many toppings to choose from, like ketchup, mustard, onions, mayonnaise, chili, relish, and more, it is truly good for many people. Nowadays, there is also the option of purchasing plant-based sausages for consumers who prefer it. Do you enjoy eating hot dogs? If so, what are your favorite toppings to use? Let us know in the comments below. And if you've enjoyed watching this video and want to learn more things relating to science, technology, history, and tons of other interesting subjects, don't forget to click the subscribe button and the bell icon to be notified when we publish new videos. Thank you for joining us today on Feed My Curiosity. See you next time. Take care.